In this part of the trip, we took the Shinkansen or bullet train from Kyoto to Odawara. We rent a car in Odawara so that we can move freely around the Japanese Alps. We then drive to the peaceful town of Hakone and have a short and relaxing hike around Lake Ashi in hopes we can see Mount Fuji in the distance. We drive towards the alpine area of Nagano and see the castle in Matsumoto. We then spend the night in Yamanuchi and see the snow monkeys take a hot bath in the morning at Jigokurani. Then we finally move deep into the Japanese Alps to climb the active volcano of Yakirake. The next day we marvel at the alpine scenery while taking a walk in Kamikochi before going back to the area around Mount Fuji. This is the story of my journey into the Japanese Alps. We finally got some wheels, and it was a nice surprise to discover that our car, although small, it was very well equipped. Hakone is a small village built by a lake, which is a good spot to see Mount Fuji. Well, not always. We are talking about 7-Eleven here, so you have all kinds of food. Uh, it's fresh food. What do you want? Sushi, probably a salad here, or probably you want a prawn soup? Okay, we have prawn soup. There you go. You choose and all of this is fresh, which is awesome. On the way to Nagano, we were lucky enough to see the last cherry blossom, since the season had ended sooner than usual. But fortunately, as we approached the mountains, the weather had preserved some cherry blossom for us. The scenery became more and more interesting, revealing high mountains and green fields. We were arriving at the doorstep of the Japanese Alps, Matsumoto. Matsumoto Castle is one of the few that preserves its original materials entirely in wood. So if you want to enter, you must do it with all respect and no shoes. Inside, you will find an exhibition of ancient artifacts. You can see the openings for the archers and a tower that was used to observe the moon, with a great panoramic view. Hey, it's warm, man, eh, mate? You like it? <laughs> Yeah, is it good? <laughs> Jigokudani is a park where you can see macaques, also known as snow monkeys. These furry friends care little for the cold weather because they like to swim in hot springs. They are used to humans and as far as I could see, they are not aggressive at all. And so, after a long journey, and almost losing my drone for flying under a bridge in front of a dam's gate, finally, we reach the heart of the Japanese Alps.
Kamikochi is surrounded by impressive mountains. One of them is not just a mountain, but an active volcano, Mount Yakedake. And because we like challenges, we decided to climb it. And although we had the stupid idea of doing it without proper equipment, it was an unforgettable experience. but happy to have enjoyed of such an imposing natural place, to have made some new friends, and having had a taste of the local Japanese hospitality. As we were coming out of the mountains, someone finally decided to show up. His Majesty of White Hair, Mount Fuji. I am in the Sakura Festival, there's a lot of flowers. This is ice cave, guys. But now we are hiking in Aokigahara Forest. Hundreds of people decide to commit suicide in this forest. <laughs> 